Welcome back. A tablespoon of nutmeg. You want a cup of milk, half cup of shredded coconut, one tin of condensed milk. And we're also going to add some sugar. I am using two cups of sugar. You can lessen the amount of sugar because remember the condensed milk is also sweet. So let's begin. I am going to add my one cup of full cream milk and my sugar and the entire tin of sweetened condensed milk and all of the spices. I also decided to add some clove powder. That's optional. So we're going to give it a good mix and bring everything to a boil. So on medium high heat, remember to keep stirring because it's, it is going to stick and you don't want anything overflowing as you can see how much it has reduced. So we are getting there. Again, keep stirring, keep paying attention. So the perfect temperature of a taffy is on your screen at the moment. So that's the proper temperature you want your taffy to be at. So continuing, we're going to get this taffy to a nice dark color. So at this point, you have seen how much it has reduced. And I am almost at the home stress, stretch, sorry. I am going to check it with my thermometer. Click the bell for new videos. So I check the taffy and it is ready. So I am now going to prepare my dish that I am going to place the taffy in with a slight amount of spray. And we're going to pour it over and make sure that it is evenly distributed in the pan. And we're going to let that cool. But before we let it cool, we're going to add our shredded coconut. And once it has cooled, you can see the beautiful color. And let's cut into this taffy. You can see it's not too soft where it is sticking on a pan. It is not hard. It's just the perfect consistency for me. This is how I prefer my taffy. So let me just show you how well it is stretching. Really nice, really nice in flavor. The coconut have added an extra amount of flavor plus a delightful bite to it so it's really easy and enjoyable if you don't have a candy thermometer just pay close attention to it keep checking it if you're not sure i strongly suggest that you get a thermometer or else you may end up with fudge and even if you end up with fudge it's a good compromise but still if you're intention is to make taffy make taffy so i think you should get a thermometer and give it a try as i said the proper temperature was listed